a model for the process of informational research. This tutorial looks at informational research, such as that done in the humanities and in literature reviews in the social sciences and sciences. A great deal of what passes for student research these days is just a process of gathering data, synthesizing it, and reporting on what you have found. You gather information from various sources, and once you have enough information, you read through it, gain an understanding of what you've read, and then explain your understanding in an essay, referring to and quoting from your sources as needed. This, however, is not really research. The goal of research is not to compile and report on information, but to use information as a tool to solve a problem or deal with an issue. Let's look at a model for this kind of research. Genuine research begins with a question that focuses on some problem or issue that needs to be addressed. For example, to what extent do the Taliban represent a genuine vision of Islam? This question, which is highly controversial in itself, demands that you study Taliban teaching about Islam in relation to the teachings of Islam's holy books or mainstream teachings to determine to what extent they reflect traditional Islamic teachings and to what extent they deviate from such teachings. Armed with the question, you begin analyzing your data with a view to determining what information is relevant and how it contributes to answering the question. Your analyzed data now becomes information, that is, processed material that can now help you to answer your question. Think of information as data that has been thought through, organized into various points of view, and so on. In that form, you can look at it properly so that the answer to your question can emerge. The result is a research paper which evaluates the information, presents various viewpoints, debates them, and comes up with an answer to your question in the form of a conclusion. Study this model in its complete form. If you'd like to go over any part of it, play the tutorial again. This ends the informational research process model tutorial. For more tutorials, return to the menu.